How did you know this? I didn't know at all. I found that it actually did a language. On location in San Francisco, the Golden Gate Bridge looking very, very good, but not so much during dawn of the Planet of the Apes. It is destroyed, but Caesar is back, and that's what's so great about this movie. Andy Serkis, and of course, uh, some new humans to contend with. You know, Caesar says it really well in the film, you know, family, home, future. Yeah. Um, and, you know, my character, Malcolm, you know, is you know, one of the leads that you know, we're trying to it's interesting because we're trying to build a civilization, you know, and then what is a civilization and what, you know, what are we doing it for and why are we doing it, you know, and these things come up in the film and, and you, you know, you, you work for the community that are out there doing that and fighting for those things and, and, it, and, it, and it brings up a lot of conflicted emotions and nothing is, is I think we spoke about that last night, nothing is black and white. It is on the ground, it's complicated and you have to solve problems on the move you know, in the moment, you know, and which is a lot of seasons in my relationship. It's not just given and taken for granted. It's built or it's broken and then, it, and then it's reformed in a new way. And, um, you know, when you are at, at the front of it, as Malcolm going, goes out to the village and as, as, as your character Dreyfus has to make these big decisions and as Ellie here, you know, we risk a lot that, that you know, y y you've got to take responsibility. You've got to think on your feet. You've got to remain open, and, you and you've got to be good at what you do. If, you if, you if you're not prepared, you know, then you will find yourself in the wrong situation, and making it, the wrong choice. And it doesn't change. No. The world yeah. is the new world Yeah. <laughs> is the same as the old world because yeah. you're faced with the same adversity yeah. and, 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 you, and you've still got to make choices and big decisions. We've been through hell together. We spent four years, four years, fighting that virus and then another four fighting each other. It was chaos. The first time you speak to the humans, one word, it's just, it just resonates. Do you know what, remember what, what is that word? Can you just, can you give it's, me? Can I give you that? Yes. Yeah, 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 he says go and it's, A little bigger than that. Oh, well, like, <laughs> well, when he shouts it, you want me to do it? <laughs> yeah. Oh no, I can't no, do that, okay. that's movie secret. Okay. He, he goes, go! Like that. Bring such humanity that, to this character. That's what's amazing. I mean, it's, I don't, it's, but it's all in the eyes, and I suppose that is acting too, isn't it? It is. Ways. It is. I mean, it's, you know, uh, you know, people say, well, you know, you're you're just doing monkey movements, and it's not really about the, the creating of a chimpanzee. It's actually the character. It's all about character. And Caesar is a conflicted uh, human in ape skin in in many ways. He's he's brought up with human beings, believes he's human. Um, so. It, it, for me, it was, it was it, seeing his growth. Is these films are all about reflecting humanity? They're, we are we're we're using we anthropomorphizing apes as a way of of seeing something about the human condition, saying something about empathy, about prejudice, about uh, family, you know, about family. Yeah, exactly. Dawn of the Planet of the Apes, bigger, better, one of the best. So be sure to look for it in your real time theater.